everyone and welcome to what goes around comes around live i'm your host meeson howell and this is live from the atelier this is our evening show so crack open a bottle of wine maybe a little bubbles whatever your nighttime treat is treat yourself and pull up what goes around comes around live on amazon.com slash what goes around comes around or Facebook, YouTube, Instagram, or what goes around NYC.com, whichever is your favorite place to go, that's where we are. So we've designed it that way. You can't get rid of us. But if you want to shop all the items tonight, head over to Amazon.com slash what goes around comes around or what goes around NYC.com. So tonight's show is all about the CFDAs. So I'm excited for this one because last night, was it last night or Sunday night? The other day, <laughs> we saw the amazing CFDA Awards, which was hosted by Anne Hathaway and by the chairman, Tom Brown, who this is his second year hosting it. And he chose the Natural History Museum, which we love. Kim Kardashian was there, Amazon actually. Amazon Fashion was a big part of it. They sponsored it, absolutely incredible. And then of course, we had none other than like Serena Williams, I mean, so many people, which we will get into here momentarily. So let's bring out our very first item, but let me know where you guys are tuning in from. Karina Montero, welcome. We got our wonderful moderator, Grace, with us here tonight as well, guys. So say hello, let me know where everyone's tuning in from, and let's get ready to shop, okay? All right, my first item, and as you can see, I'm already bringing out the gloves. Yes, we are, absolutely. The first item I have for us tonight is an Hermes piece, because if you're going to CFDA Awards, we're going to have the most amazing items, the most amazing accessories with us. And by the way, the CFDA stand for the Council of Fashion Designers of America. So it celebrates all of the American fashion designers. It's a huge, like, biggest award season. It's like Oscars, but for fashion. Anne Hathaway was wearing Ralph Lauren, so I decided to wear Ralph Lauren tonight. My cute little polo bear. So this is basically the outfit I would have worn had I gone to the CFDAs, obviously a martini would have been my bag, but cute, cute with little slippers on, of course. So that's what we're wearing tonight, guys. We are all for it. So first piece I have for you all is the amazing, beautiful Kelly Pochette from Hermes. I mean, who else would have been wearing this piece? Because I certainly would have been wearing this piece to the CFDAs. This is the Hermes nada and attain swift leather kelly pochette beautiful beautiful piece this piece is from 2021 it's a hss or a horseshoe stamp a special order piece this is from the collection of horseshoes so basically the collection of horseshoes the horseshoe stamp or the hss is basically a rack order or a special order if you will so it means that this bag was custom made so basically, the one thing is like, can you get a Birkin? Can you get a Kelly? Can you get a Kelly Pochette like here? But then after you get one, the next thing is, can you get a special order? 
and that's the hardest thing to do next, is to get a special order. So love, love, love this piece so much. Absolutely stunning item. But this piece, $34,500. Beautiful, beautiful piece. So the Kelly Pochette first was designed by Jean-Paul Gaultier in 2004. So we've seen it since then. And now we have it here in stunning, stunning other items as well. So absolutely love this piece. $34,500. Not only do we have the Nada Swift Leather, we also have a Tane. So the base of it is Nada and then rose gold hardware. This piece is brand new, comes with the full, full piece, full set as well. Gorgeous item. Look, this is absolutely stunning. Let's open up this interior here. Look, more plastic on that rose gold hardware. Beautiful tan lambskin interior. Hermes dust bag, but also comes with the box, full set, everything, guys. Beautiful, there's no wear to this piece. The rest of it is nada all the way around. I mean, this color combination is absolutely stunning. Top handle is a tame. The singles are a tame. Then rose gold hardware. Right now, to my knowledge, rose gold, the only place you can get it, along with like brush gold, is, from what I'm hearing, at basically the HSS or rack order or special order collections that you have to custom make for basically yourself and be offered to do so. So I have seen, obviously, we've seen rose gold come out in the past as well and even a few years ago but things change very quickly so as i'm saying this they could bring rose gold back out on just the classic pieces so beautiful items is thirty four thousand five hundred dollars this i would say is harder to get than a mini kelly no joke it seriously is and this is actually what they would refer to as the very first you know mini kelly if you will beautiful piece thirty four thousand five hundred dollars you guys take a quick look at this my Instagram basically chat just went down for a moment, just logged me out. So I'll log myself back in so I can see all of you guys. But gorgeous, gorgeous item. Take a look at that. Be right back with you. All right, you guys, I am back. Fantastic. Instagram is back up for me. I apologize for that for a moment, guys. But beautiful piece, right? Once again, this is the Hermes 2021 Swift Leather Attain and Nada color combination with rose gold hardware. This is a special order or a rack order or HSS. So this piece, the only way you can basically get it is to be offered to make one yourselves. So they have a beautiful list. It's actually kind of a really cool thing to go in and do. It's so much fun. Absolutely love it. So once again, $34,500. The Kelly Pochette first was created by Jean-Paul Gaultier in 2004. It was known as the original Mini Kelly. So a beautiful piece to wear to the CFDA Awards. I mean, walking with this, you're, I mean, you killed it. The rest of your outfit could be super sleek. Jenna Lyons was there last night. She, of course, wore just a simple black tuxedo and had a you know, lime, kind of not a lime green, almost like a Kelly green, like a bright green uh, Bottega Veneta. I think it was the, not the Jody, it's the Jody pouch, not the Jody bag, but the Jody pouch. I can't remember what the pouch is called with a knot in it. But beautiful look. She would have looked killer with this. So Jenna, if you're listening, I think you need this next time for whatever event you go to. It's perfect. Perfect. So only $34,500. It is so beautiful, right? Absolutely stunning. All right. Let's move on to our next item. So 
If you guys want to be like Kim Kardashian who wore a Chrome Hearts gown that looked very vintage 90s, almost kind of 80s rocker vibe, then this is going to be a great piece for you, but a little more flair, a little more wow, a little pop, a little pizzazz. This is the Chanel red and then multicolor satin quilted mini barrel bag, but with the Gripois printing all over it. So this is a 1986 to 88 era. Can you believe that? Guys, I'm gonna say again, 1986 to 88 production period. Insane, and satin and quilted in this grid condition with white as a base. I mean, I could go on and on, but I'm not gonna say more because I'm literally gonna be like nonstop and talk about this bag all night. This is insane. The fact that we have this piece, only here what goes around comes around, are we gonna find these amazing of condition pieces. Absolutely stunning. Gorgeous red leather trim all the way around. Now, Gripois. Gripois was an amazing, basically, jewelry glass designer, almost like a mix of the two, but her name was Augustine Gripois, and she actually was the first to kind of master the art of creating jewelry out of glass, crystal, metal, and of course, like artificial pearls, all things that Coco Chanel loved. So that is when Gripois kind of became a big thing was in the 1920s, Coco Chanel discovered Gripois and was like, oh my God, you gotta make all this stuff for me. But Gripois goes back all the way to 1869 when Augustine Gripois first kind of came about it. She mastered poor glass. And then of course, Coco Chanel herself, who loved the Byzantine empire, who loved kind of Roman empire things. She loved these jewel tones. So you see the reds, the purples, the blues, the greens. So incredible. And then of course, the faux pearls. So very, very much a Gripois style, and it has lasted throughout the decades. Even though Augustine Gripois clearly is not with us anymore from 1869, <laughs> we still have these amazing pieces today. And we see, we saw Victoire de Castellan and Karl Lagerfeld really use a lot of it throughout the 80s and the 90s, as you can see here. And we're seeing it even come back here recently as well. $2,500 for literally a piece of history right here. This is insane. Leather woven chain strap. You get that gorgeous, gorgeous, Leather tassel right here. CC zipper opening. I love this. And this little barrel bag. This would have been so cute and perfect, really on anyone who's wearing just a simple chic gown, or if you're wearing like a red gown or anything of the sorts, this would have been so perfect. Because look, either throw it over your shoulder. If you're at the CFDA, you can also throw it, throw it inside here, make it a cute little clutch can even throw, which dare I hate to say, the tassel in here to make a cute little barrel clutch just like that. And this is like literally would have honored Karl Lagerfeld. You know, beautiful piece here. I know he's not an American fashion designer, but like obviously like he just, they have an international designer award, which went to um, J.W. Anderson, Jonathan Anderson. Fantastic. Um, but Karl Lagerfeld could have won that award too. So just like this. Perfect, perfect piece. And then you could have even worn it as like a, just holding the chain strap. I love when people do this, when it's literally just like holding it like this, you know, just like the chains wrapped around your hand, almost like it's a cute little clutch and stand it back just like that, just like that, like so cute and fun. We love that. And then look at this interior guys, beautiful leather interior. I mean, Virtually nowhere, zip pocket with satin lining inside the zip pocket. Beautiful piece, 24 karat plated gold. This piece is only $2,500. Absolutely stunning, you guys. Incredible. I mean, only here what goes around comes around. I can find this amazing condition. And this kind of rare piece, this Gripois piece, nowhere else but here. Stunning. $2,500 for this beauty. Oh my gosh, guys, head over to Amazon if you want to join us. Amazon.com slash what goes around comes around. Handbag Hangout crew is there tonight. It's fantastic. Oh, Deanna Favriato, need your sweater. Oh my God, thank you. This is what I would have worn to CFDAs. Not the sweater, but what the bear is wearing. It would have been a Ralph Lauren tux with Ralph Lauren slippers and a martini. This is basically Anne Hathaway who hosted CFDAs last night. She wore Ralph Lauren, so I wore Ralph Lauren. Very Mean Girls. Is it Wednesday? It's not Wednesday. But, you know, opening a Mean Girls line. <laughs> so it's beautiful. Deanna, thank you. I don't think they make these anymore, you guys. Sad part. I really don't think they make them. And I think they do, but, like, not the martini one. I've seen, guess who has this one, though? Chris Jenner. 
I've only seen a handful of people have it, Chris Jenner and like two other people on Instagram. So very happy with it. I paid an egregious amount of money for it and I don't regret it one bit. I wear this only during the holidays, like literally Halloween ends and then after the first new year, this goes back. Oh, Deanna, you look for it every year? Well, Deanna, next time I find it, I will send it to you, I promise. Follow us, Deanna, at what goes around NYC or at WGACA Live and feel free to follow me as well, at Mason Henry Howell. If I find it, I'll send it to you. Deanna, I agree, Martini Bear is the best one out of them all. I do want also the skiing one. I'm trying to find that one. So I'm gonna find it, but it's a good one, right? Deanna, I got you. Don't you worry. All right, Louis Vuitton, white Epi twist top handle bag in the size MM. This is stunning, guys. This is from the 2018 collection. Beautiful white Epi, but there's something different about this Epi from the classic Epi we saw from 1985 when it was first released. This piece actually, the Epi here goes diagonally directional. So in that diagonal form, Epi back from 1985 when it was first released went horizontal. So I love that Nicholas Gasquier, he kind of updated the Epi leathers a little bit here. And now we're seeing Pharrell Williams come out with it again. It's so iconic and amazing. This piece was actually first released in 2015, the twist bag, they have the chain version, so many different versions, but this is a limited edition version under Nicolas Gasquier. I love it. Beautiful piece. Look at this. Gorgeous, gorgeous silver hardware. And when you turn that, that lock basically, it's an LV, then it's just, boom, a V. How fun is that to open? And then you get, of course, the palm and the luggage tag. It's fantastic. Stephanie, welcome. So happy to have you guys. If you want to be like Stephanie and join us in the chat over on Amazon, our handbag hangout crew, head over to amazon.com slash what goes around comes around. Okay, beautiful Alcantara lining in that gorgeous dark yellow, huge color for fall winter 2023. So this piece, I love it because this is showing like, you know, for CFDAs, it's just fun to walk into something a little different. Like guys, I might be heading to St. Bart's, by the way, if you missed our show, St. Bart's earlier, might be heading to St. Bart's right after this. It's beautiful, right? Melissa Northway, I know, right? So cute. It's so adorable. Guys, if you want to shop this, amazon.com slash what goes around comes around. Scroll down a little bit. You'll see a video of me. Just click on that. You're good to go. And you'll see all the products on the left. I'm here on the right. On my screen, it's the right. But on you guys, it's the left. You're looking at the screen. <laughs> I still have to do this, guys. Left, right. Got it. Handbag historian. What do you call a matte person? MapQuest? I'm not MapQuest. Google Maps. <laughs> MapQuest. TBT to MapQuest. Love it. Cartographer. Thank you. Thank you, Grace. By the way, guys, Grace Mazingale, our new host and moderator, is here with us as well, doing a great time. So ha say hello to Grace, everyone. Everyone say hello to Grace, and Grace say hello to everyone. I was trying to say both at the same time. <laughs> But you know what I'm saying. Stephanie, hello. I'm doing great, Stephanie. How are you, darling? Kisses to you and your son as well. Beautiful. I am Goonie. Hello. Great to have you with us. All right, guys. But this piece, beautiful pink and blue. I love the acrylic handle. The great part is this can work definitely at the CFDA's events because it's small enough as a top handle to still work for an evening bag and still hold all of your items for the night. You know what? One of my things is I love a good gala. A good event but I always tell everyone eat beforehand but also you can't if you're gonna be photographed because you don't want a stomach for the photos but you're never gonna get enough food at these events you really really aren't so this is the perfect way to do it you can have little snacks in here I love it cute little snacks on the inside and you're all set oh Melissa we will tell Santa and we'll have him drop this off on your way just make sure that you give Santa your credit card number <laughs> All right, beautiful. I also love the base of this bag because you get this kind of curve down here at the bottom. It's stunning, stunning piece, right? Most I know, right? Got to have snacks. Always got to have snacks for these events. You know where I also bring snacks? This is really, really bad of me. Weddings. I bring snacks to weddings, guys. Because, like, you just don't know. You really just don't know. So my bag at any wedding is about this size so I can bring snacks. And, like, now I bring snacks for others because... Guys, sometimes that wedding food, by the time it actually comes out to you, because you know, I'm always in the, I'm always in the back. I don't know what it is, but I always get to sit in the back table so you don't ever see the food. 
Anyways, I can go on a tangent about all of that. <laughs> so, snacks for your wedding or for the CFDA. Now, a beautiful slip pocket, and you also get another slip pocket over here, which has this cute little mirror. We love the cute little mirror, so it's perfect to, you know, the bathroom line might be long, or we may not want to run into someone in the industry you know, so you can just do it at your table and sit with your little posse and crew. But beautiful piece. This piece, $4,500, Melissa. I know it's so fun, it's so simple, it's lots going on, but so little, like it's just that perfect kind of base here. You get the luggage tag, which is simply colored in a different color. Cute little leaf that's not too over the top, and that simple acrylic handle. Making it see-through, I think, really helps that simplicity of it, Melissa. So I completely agree with you. Only $4,500, guys, for this beautiful, beautiful piece. Now, the next piece, this. This is also very Jenna Lyons, in my opinion. I don't know, I just saw her, and like, she's honestly like my style icon. She's also my crush. Like, love her. But love this piece. Melissa, I know we're loving the acrylic handles. So 70s, very 70s for it. But guys, this is so, so just like Jenna Lyons, just like cool girl. This honestly could have worked with Kim Kardashian's dress, with Serena Williams' dress, who won Fashion Icon of the Year Award. She also uh, was wearing Tom Brown. So, I mean, her dress was so poofy, she didn't really need a uh, clutch with it. But I, I think everyone needs a bag. I designed my outfits around the bags. I know, Stephanie, obsessed. We have Thanksgiving coming up soon. I know, I know, guess what? Black Friday deals, guys. It's a huge one. I can't tell you what it is yet, but it's better than Prime Day, swear to God, it's insane. It's insane. Jake, oh my God, Jake, it's so good to see you. Jake, I know, I'm so bad. I, I know what I owe you. I know what I owe you, and I promise it's coming. You'll get it at some point, I swear to God. I know, love the green. We live for the green here, guys. This is beautiful hunter green. This bag is the Gucci green leather zoomy bag in a size small with both gold and silver hardware. So this was designed by Alessandra Michel for spring 2019 collection. And it was named after Zumi Razo, who basically was like a multi-instrumentalist -inst and artist. She was also a designer. She was known for her work with the black lips. Good friends with Alessandra Michelle, from my understanding. This bag was designed for her. So it's just like a cool girl bag. I love it. You have the top handle. You can wear it as a clutch. Beautiful piece. I love it. I know Melissa, this green, incredible. And guys, you're going to die over this chain. Look at this chain. This isn't just like any other classic chain, but you basically have these cool designs that are almost like a horse bit, but not like a modern horse bit. It is so chic. And then look at this on. It's just so amazing. Love that. You know I love when it just hangs down here. It's perfect. I love a chain that just hangs in a longer chain. That's chic to walk into CFDAs. Or even if you like kind of did the double up around it and let it hang in the front. Here we go. We know, you know what I'm trying to do here. Perfect. Just like that. That's what I'm trying to do. Perfect, like so chic like that. And now look, you get a slip pocket in the back here. It's so perfect. Melissa, I know, oh my gorgeous is right. Oh my Givenchy. That's really my favorite thing. Oh my Givenchy? <laughs> oh my Gucci, that's what this is. Oh my Gucci. But beautiful burgundy interior, very like Chanel-esque. You know that burgundy interior, she actually was inspired by her uniforms at the convent. So I love, love, love that we have this beautiful burgundy interior here as well. Stunning piece, $2,150 for this amazing item, guys. It's no longer in production either from what I've seen. So it doesn't mean they won't bring it back, but guys, this green color, this is like a neutral. It really is. The Zumi bag, it's so cute. $2,150 is an Alessandro Michel design. Remember, he's no longer at the helm of Gucci. I'll say he's no longer with us. He is still with us, just not at the helm of Gucci. <laughs> and he, of course, we are excited to see what he does next, but he left back in November of 2022. And guys, this actually comes off as well if you want it to. I mean, why would you want to remove that chain though? It's so cute and so precious. This is adorable. $2,150 for this amazing piece, you guys. Absolutely stunning. Gucci kind of day, Zumi collection. We love the Zumi collection, Gucci kind of day. The Gucci kind of day, if you're just tuning in, I was telling them that this is from the spring 2019 collection. It was named after Zumi Rosso, Ros Rosau, Zumi Rosau, you know, 
multi-instrumentalist, and of course is an artist, a designer, but she was known for the Black Lips and from my knowledge is friends with Alessandra Michelle. And we know a lot of these designers like Marc Jacobs, Karl Lagerfeld, they name bags after people they know and love. So I love that, it's kind of like a nice tribute. I thought it was perfect for the CFDA Awards. We love it. Beautiful piece, beautiful, beautiful. Oh, Melissa, loving Yo-Yo Kusama collab and Tom Ford, let me know if you got any pieces. Ah, of course, we don't have any Tom Ford with us, but I do have a beautiful Yo-Yo Kusama piece. And I also have a Takashi Murakami piece for you as well, Melissa, I'm bringing that out. Guys, you wanna see any other items, I'm happy to bring them out. So next I'm gonna bring out, out of Melissa's request, this stunning Yo-Yo Kusama. There she is. It's the new version of Yo-Yo Kusama. We have old ones too, but they sell so quickly. But we have the new one. This is the Louis Vuitton Yo-Yo Kusama, Ya Yo Kusama. I can never say her name correctly. Come on, girl. Help me a little bit. This is the <laughs> Yo-Yo Kusama Louis Vuitton 2023 collaboration, monogram canvas, 3D dots, Alma BB or baby size, basically with beautiful gold hardware. Now guys, the first Yoya Kusama collection came out in 2012 and it was under Marc Jacobs when he was at Louis Vuitton. It was one of his last artist collaborations before he left as creative director of Louis Vuitton. Beautiful piece. I love that about 10, 11 years later, they came out with this. They announced their collaboration in 2022 and then in January 1st, literally 2023, this hit the stores. And of course we have the pieces here. We have them right away. We have the surfboard as well, which is so fun and cool. Absolutely gorgeous piece. But this is just like bringing to the CFDA awards this piece. I think this is such a great nod to like past artist collaborations to the respect you've had in the past. So I love, love, love this piece. Absolutely gorgeous. Melissa, I know, perfect size, right? It's so amazing. And by the way, cool part is Yoya Kusama, when they first came out, that they had the very strict dots waves, which was like the infinity wave. So it looked like so many dots and it actually were very architecturally like perfectly round, perfectly spaced all throughout. Here we have then that looks more hand painted on like some of her most recent artwork. Now, if you look on the inside 2012 pieces, I wish I had one here. I'm going to, I'll find a photo for you guys or I'll bring one out next time but on the inside, it actually has these kind of dots. So I love they reversed it. And on some of the interior pieces of some of these, I don't believe this one has it. No, it does, it does. Okay, good, I'm so excited. So they now reversed it again. This is the original design by Ayo Kusama, those affinity dots. And this used to be on the interior, but now this is on the interior and this is on the exterior. So I love it, it's so pretty, right? Absolutely stunning. Drummond, Drummond Money, Drum and money, sorry, apologies. Yes, yes, very pretty, right? Gorgeous, and you're so right, Melissa. Perfect size, it's gorgeous. We love this piece, right? We love it. Gorgeous piece, and now let's look at the inside real quick. Now this is brand new, straight from the collection. It comes with a lock, key, and clochette that are still wrapped up, but look, you get the little pumpkin on there. So the pumpkin's a huge thing that is all for, for and fabs. Melissa, I know polka dots are so fab for this piece. Now, I'm gonna tell you guys as well. So the Yoya Kusama pumpkin, all right, I was looking at new apartments that we were going to move into and basically there's this one place. It was so gorgeous, so beautiful and stunning, but the pump and outside of it was a real Yoya Kusama sculpture in our front yard. And I was like, we have to live here, even though we're gonna share it with like 5,000 other people, I don't care. We didn't end up living there. It was too hotel-y for us. We love like a modern look, but we need a little bit of warmth, just a little bit. So, beautiful piece. Okay, Drummond, I'm glad your stream fixed. Okay, great. Sorry about that. Yes, sometimes these live streams do get a little glitchy, but feel free to refresh your page, guys, and you're good to go. This piece, beautiful item. Tristita, great question. What is the price? $5,750, you guys, this beautiful piece. Once again, it's brand new. You get the infinity dots on the interior, which is very indicative of that original collection. You get the original Louis Vuitton tag there, slip pocket, beautiful piece. Look at that, nowhere to the base, guys. Once again, this is a brand new item. Nowhere to that bichette trim. The keys are inside of the clochette here. You get the lock here, still wrapped up in paper. 
Beautiful. And then let's not forget an original Louis Vuitton dust bag with it. And of course, a complimentary what goes around comes around dust bag. Now my favorite part is the Vachetta tag here, the Louis Vuitton Kusama tag is in that pumpkin shape. It's so fun, right? Beautiful, beautiful item. Once again, $5,750. And guys, if you want to shop it, just head over to amazon.com slash what goes around comes around. And you'll scroll down a little bit. You'll see me. You'll see the beautiful carousel of items. And you cannot miss it. But act fast because I know Melissa already added to her wish list. She probably has it in her cart too. Don't you, Melissa? <laughs> it's so pretty, so fun. You're so right. Easily can wear it as a crossbody as well if you like. Beautiful piece. Oh, Stephanie, thank you so much. I know. Beautiful sweater, right? Guys, it's the CFDA collection or show, so this is what I would have worn to the CFDAs, this, what, the, what the bear's wearing. And by what I mean, what he's wearing is that martini. That's what I've worn, worn to the CFDAs. <laughs> but I would have been just like Anne Hathaway, who hosted it, and gorgeous Ralph Lauren. All right, this piece, once again, guys, $5,750, brand new, comes with all the accoutrements with it. Stunning item, guys. The collection is going to go away soon, so it's no longer around. So it's a limited edition piece. I'm so happy to see them kind of bringing out some amazing kind of limited editions again. So speaking of limited editions, I also have another, I have a Louis Vuitton Takashi Murakami piece that I want to bring out for you guys next. That's what I'm bringing out next, because Melissa, if you love Yoyo Kusama, if you guys all love Kusama, you're going to die over this piece. This next piece is the Louis Vuitton Takashi Murakami Cherry Blossoms from the Spring Summer 2003 runway. Isn't this insane, you guys? This is gorgeous. I'm going to set her up here on our side. Beautiful, beautiful piece. I'm obsessed with this. This is so stunning and so beautiful and fun. So the Cherry Blossoms collection, like I said, first came out in Spring Summer 2003. So Takashi Murakami was not the first artist that Louis Vuitton partnered with. But they were probably the most, one of the most popular out there, and still is to this day. Because they actually ran this collection, the Takashi Murakami collaboration, all the way up to 2014-15. But this piece is beautiful. This is the Takashi Murakami Cherry Blossom Papillon size 30, which means it measures at 30 centimeters across the base. Now, the Papillon has been around since the 1960s. I mean, it's very 60s style, very mod, very you know, tubular, singular cylinder style bag. I love saying tubular, makes me feel just like cool. You know what I mean? A beautiful piece, spring, summer 2003. You get the gorgeous lock here. Very different from a normal Papillon because not only do you get the beautiful cherry blossoms, look how happy they are. Cause they're like, I'm ready to go home with someone. I'm ready to be put into a shopping bag. Add me now, done and done. But it also, instead of a zipper has a flap and wow guys, holy crap. Look at that interior, that Pachetta trim. Minor darkening around, but other than that, guys, there's virtually nowhere to this Pachetta trim. Only here, what goes around comes around, are you gonna find this amazing condition item. You can get a little clochette with it, keys, the lock, the bow. You get the gorgeous studding, which was a aesthetic that Takashi Murakami himself put on most of the bags he created with Marc Jacobs. I mean, this is amazing, right? Incredible piece. This piece is only $1,950. Melissa, I know, we love the shape. Once again, guys, $1,950, that's insane. Spring, summer 2003, now the cherry blossoms were discontinued literally right after they were released. Wow. Look at that beige Alcantara lining, you guys. There's no wear to it whatsoever. And Alcantara line is basically a suede adjacent, so it's more scratch resistant, water resistant, and stain resistant, so it's made to last. Beautiful piece. I know Melissa, right, looks brand new. Oh, Stephanie, say hi to your son, Jacob, for me. Tell him we say hello. A beautiful piece, guys. Oh, getting that complimentary what goes around comes around dust bag stuck in there. That's okay, just put it right in. But look how fun this is and easy. It's so chic. I know Melissa looks brand new because guys, here what goes around comes around. We're gonna bring you the best condition items out there, just like this piece here. Everything is authenticity guaranteed. We've been doing this for 30 years, so kind of got down a little bit. <laughs> But in all seriousness, it goes through a very rigorous authentication process. And I mean, all these pieces we bring to you are just absolutely incredible. Look at this. $1,950, guys. That is such an insane price for this. Once again, head over to Amazon.com slash what goes around comes around to shop it. It's so easy. 
quick, I mean, just love this piece. We love, love, love it. And now, if you wanna pair with this, we have another kind of really cool piece that I can't believe is still here with us. So I snagged it so I can bring it to you. If you love the bags, you're going to love this. Cherry blossoms, again, but not just cherry blossoms. These are the Louis Vuitton Cosmic Blossoms. Pop this piece back. Don't worry, we'll bring her back out here in a second. Show you guys. But the Cosmic Blossom scarf, look at this. Insane. Beautiful piece. It's from 2000. And 10 is when the Cosmic Blossoms came out. But in the same, I love this. Guys, this is basically a stole. It's a vertical stole. We love this. I know, Grace, we're in love, right? Grace, did you see this earlier? Insane, crazy, right? Only $715, you guys, no longer in production. It is 100% cotton with raw edges, which I love those raw edges. It's amazing. Okay, I'm glad you saw it earlier, because if not, I was gonna have to hold it back for you, because I know someone's gonna buy it tonight, guys, so look at it now, beautiful piece on. And this is like, I love a stole, especially if you are you know, wearing like Jenna Lyons did or any of our wonderful male attendants or any of the fabulous women in like suits. A stole on a suit is just like fabulous, especially if you're wearing a, like a single color suit or anything like that, perfectly great drapes on, or if you're wearing a fabulous, Fabulous outfit. You can just throw this on. Very like kind of muted colors. Put this on, you're all set. And now this might be too much, but when's it ever too much? It's never enough. The cherry blossoms with the cosmic blossoms. I mean, this is kind of a look. It's not great, but I could see it. I can convince myself in my head that this is beautiful. And together guys, below 3,000. $1,950. $715. This is no longer in basically production anymore. So the only place you can get it is here on the pre love market. And where else are you going to get it except for what goes around comes around? That's right. That's me singing. If you hated that, I'm so sorry. Please don't let the numbers drop. Ooh. All right. <laughs> $1,950. dollars $715 for this beautiful piece. Oh my God, you're so right. Hillary Duff moment. Guys, I'm just living. My Hilary Duff fantasy, my um, Sing to Me Paolo. What's that fantasy? The one where she goes to Rome, the Roman adventure of Hilary Duff. Best movie in the entire world. I don't care what anyone says. Beautiful. Look at this open, guys. Only $715. This is insane. So, so beautiful. We love this. Love, love, love. Where's everyone tuning in from tonight? Oh, Lizzie McGuire, not Hillary Duff, I'm dead. I mean, it was Hillary Duff, but you know, Lizzie. Lizzie McGuire. Where's everyone tuning in from tonight? We'd love to hear from you guys. Let me know if there's any other amazing bags I can bring out for you. I'm happy to do so. Oh, Stephanie, I know you're in Ohio, the good old Ohio. By the way, guys, if you're like me and Grace, we love the cold, we love it, but we're ready to, you know, maybe skirt out a bit. We had our St. Bart show earlier, so if you missed that, just head over to amazon.com slash live slash what goes around NYC and you can rewatch them or head over to what goes around NYC.com. Oh my God, Rachel, welcome back. Atlanta, ooh, we love the hot ATL. Mm, we love it. I love the hot ATL, we're all down there for it. Isabella, hi darling, so good to see you. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. Instagram, you guys are being a little quiet over there tonight. Say hello or come over and join the Handbag Hangout crew on amazon.com slash what goes around comes around. Rachel, it's so happy to have you back as well. Okay, before I forget, let's bring out our next item. <laughs> so you know, I could just chat with you guys all night long. Okay, this is so chic, guys. We're seeing a resurgence in denim. I love it. Oh, Stephanie, here you go. Chanel bag right here. This is amazing, you guys. I love this. We're about to see a huge resurgence in denim. We're already seeing it for the fall, winter, kind of ready to wear trend on the street wear. And actually, Grace pointed this out for us. A lot of the denim on denim or Canadian tuxedo, which I know you probably shouldn't call that anymore, but I love calling it that. It's like one of my favorite things. So Barry, Justin Timberlake, Britney Spears, VMAs. If you don't know what I'm talking about, Google it right now, right now. But this is amazing, like an all denim look. Or if you just wanna put a little spot of denim, this is it. This is a beautiful Chanel blue denim CC pouch from 2002 to 2003. $1,450, beautiful. 
Oh, Fasty, thank you for the, for the uh, smile. We love a little smile. Just give me some emoji, guys, some likes, all of it. We love it here. Beautiful interior, look at this. Gorgeous CC nylon interior. I love that. You guys know this is my favorite interior, this large oversized CC. And I love that they did like a dark navy with the denim. It's so fab. Zip pocket as well. Beautiful. It's also that same lining. <laughs> we love the lining on lining. Silver hardware. And then look, you get an acrylic clear Chanel zipper pull tab. And guys, you know, you know, I love a zipper pull tab. I live for it. Ready? You got to hear that again. Ready? And Beautiful sound. We love the sound of a good quality zipper. Look at it on that little denim tab here. It's so perfect. Guys, this piece, $1,450. It's so major. It's so insane. It's rocking my world right now. And look at this, virtually nowhere to it. CC logo. And I love how the CC logo, it almost looks like it's like, I kind of said, like that word art. That was big in like the 2000s. Very word art like. I love this. Look at that. So chic on. It's so perfect. Y2K moment. 100% right, Grace. We love it. And literally it is. 2002, 2003. Nailed it right there. Amazing piece. $1,450 for this incredible, incredible item right here. All right. Let's bring out our next piece, you guys. Next, I have the cutest little bag. If you want to have a Lizzo moment at the CFDAs, this is it, but in Balenciaga form. Are you guys dying? Look how freaking tiny this thing is. I'm obsessed with it. This won't even hold my little mini glass of wine or my little mini bottle of vodka. But guess what it does hold? Some candy, a little snack. Need a little snack? This is it. We love it. This is the Balenciaga Black Caskin Logoville Top Handle Bag in a size mini. Just kidding, it's a size large. <laughs> Funny Mason, right? Gold hardware on it. I love, it still has the Balenciaga. This is under Dimna Gavalia, who is the current creative director of Balenciaga. We've seen so many modern things from him, but I love this. It's so precious and cute. I mean, here's the thing, guys. I know it's big bag fall, but mini bags are here to stay as well. We're constantly gonna see the beautiful mini bags here, just like this piece. Once again, that whole Lizzo vibe. Easily, look at this beautiful interior, and it has a shoulder strap. Gorgeous, right? Only $998, gorgeous, gorgeous black canvas interior. There's virtually no wear to this piece. Look, no base wear. Doot -doot, cute and beautiful pebble leather. Now look, easily you can throw this in here. Just like, oh, come on. See, my hands are too big for this tiny bag. I need tiny hands with me, guys. That's what I need. All right, we're gonna get this. I swear I'm gonna get this. Honestly, the struggle, you guys don't even know how much I would kill to be the size of an Olsen twin. In my mind, I'm the size of an Olsen twin. And there we go, yes. But in reality, I'm not the size of an Olsen twin. One time I jumped on my friend, literally like destroyed his leg, he was totally fine. Like I thought he was gonna talk to me for like days. I was like, hey. But he was like, why do you think I would catch you? I was like, because I'm so tiny. I'm itsy bitsy, guys. But look at that. It's so cute. It's just so precious. You wear a crossbody. And look, I love the little long strap on it. It's just so obnoxious. But this is the piece you wear into the um, CFDAs, purse first, just hanging out. We love it. Get all the little snacks in there. A little almond, a little nut. Did you see Martha Stewart and Snoop Dogg are coming out with handbags for the lighters? Don't worry, you don't have to get that. You can just get the lighter, put it in here, you're all set. $998 for this beautiful piece. Now, I believe this piece came out spring, summer 2018. I was looking at the runway photos and I believe this is the first time we saw it. So I'm still doing some more research. There's some other places I wanna look, like off runway photos. But spring, summer 2018 is where we saw this almost dome style, almost indicative of an Hermes Bolid or an Alma bag. We know about the Alma. We love, love, love a Louis Vuitton Alma. So beautiful piece. This one, only $998, guys. I mean, this is honestly the less expensive date to the CFDAs. So it's perfect. It's beautiful. If you spend all your money on your gown and that's okay, 
she have it here. I mean, Tom Brown, expensive. Ralph Lauren, expensive. So, add a little Balenciaga, add a little French to it. You know, a little something. I also love that the CFDAs last night, like a lot of people wore American designers like Jason Wu, and of course we saw tons of other people like Vera Wang. Vera Wang actually won, what did she win last night? I think she wore like the most amazing, like, ah, oh, what was it? A oh, Board of Directors Tribute. That's what she won last night, Board of Directors Tribute. So amazing, and Kate actually won like Ready to Wear of the Year. We love Kate, if you guys don't know Kate, K-H-A-I-T-E, their store here, incredible, honestly. If you're not big into the clothing, their architectural designs, Google the stores, her husband did them. Insane. All right, here's a cute little vintage piece. We love a patent leather moment. Once again, you may not want to wait in line or you don't want to be, you know, walk into it and be like, okay, what is happening? Like, what is going on here? I don't want to talk to anyone. You can sit at your table and have this beautiful vanity case. Guess what, Kim Kardashian is there so you guys can have something to talk about. That's what you can bring up. She got her vanity case from what goes around comes around, and now you can have your vanity case from what goes around comes around. And then there, there's your opening line to Kim Kardashian. You're trying to find that line to talk to her to a pro at the CFDAs. This is your bag. This is the entry piece. It's a Chanel black patent quilted heart mirror vanity, 94 to 96 era, guys. So you're gonna die. Wait, you see the heart part. Da 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 da. Oh, I got a CC turn locket too. Boom, I blew the surprise on the bottom, but here you go. Gorgeous. Yes, that's what I was trying to say, Grace. It's an icebreaker, it's an iconic icebreaker. Wait for it. Ah, I just can't believe it. I just look at it first. Da 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 da. Look at that cute little heart, you guys. And same thing, you have the Chanel all around on the inside. That's all leather. Isn't that adorable, you guys? $5,950. This piece is from spring, summer, 1995. The 94 to 96 era piece, but we do know those heart collections that came out for the spring, summer, 95 runaway, just like this piece. So this is such an amazing piece. I mean, this is just adorable. I mean, just looks classic from the outside. CC patent logo, and this is stitched on guys. So there's another layer of leather there. And look at that white logo. I see virtually nowhere. Stunning piece. Only here what goes around comes around. Are you going to find items in this grade of condition? Absolutely insane. $5,950, guys. It is insane. It's so amazing and cute. I mean, I just can't get over it. $5,950. Remember, everything that goes around comes around is authenticity guaranteed. Let's just look at that heart again. Holy crap. Well, you might have to bleep me there. You're just going to have to bleep me at some point. Because <laughs> I, to get my point across, I might have to use a sailor's mouth every now and then. <laughs> at least for the night show, right? 24 karat plated gold on this beautiful piece, $5,950. The zipper works great, and look, you have the two layers of defense to make sure nothing falls out. Zip this up, just like that. And then you can also do the turn lock. Beautiful, once again, $5,950. Look how cute this is, it's so precious. We love it. Do like a little Ah, uh, almost there. We almost got it. <laughs> but this piece, $5,950. Honestly, in my next life, I'm going to be a carny, you guys. I want to, like, juggle the, uh, juggle everything, juggle bags. We got it all. But $5,950 for this beautiful, beautiful piece. Roaring 30s, before you were wearing a thick pair of Celine glasses. Oh, my God. Thank you. You know me? <laughs> yeah, so I took them off. They were a little reflection-y for the glass. reflection -y. It's not even a word. But yes, there's a little bit of reflection on them. Don't worry, I kind of want to bring them back. You know, that's what I just wear in general. Um, but where did I get them? I got them from Celine, but I got them like seven, eight years ago. I had to have at Celine, but under a Phoebe Philo. So now you probably can only get them on the pre-love market because they have the, uh, the Accent Grave or Accent Agoo, whichever one it is. So that is where I would recommend maybe trying the pre-love market. Sometimes we get them here. We're starting to venture into Celine a little bit. But Trek other places as well. And then they were sunglasses. I have a giant face, if you can't tell. And Roaring 30s, I had to get my lenses put in them, which honestly costs like nothing. So, amazing piece. Stephanie, another Chanel bag? We got it right here. This is the Chanel Red Quilt and Satin Half Flat Mini. Guys, 
86 to 88. This piece is almost 40 years in age. It's 35 years plus. Yeah, 35 years plus. Beautiful, beautiful piece. Or just hit 35. It's almost 35 plus. <laughs> $5,950. Guys, to find satin on the pre loved market is almost impossible. But here, what goes around comes around. We have achieved it yet again. I mean, everything we have, we're bringing the best condition. I mean, holy crap. Look at that base. Insane. No corner wear. There's no pooling. Nothing. Insane piece. 86 to 88, $5,950 for this gorgeous item. Beautiful. Now the Chanel logo is starting to fade a little bit just because it is printed on there, but it's still fully visible. Beautiful piece. And then you have, of course, the satin woven chain link. And I love the chains. The stoppers are, of course, CC logos. Beautiful. You get a slip pocket here as well. Gorgeous. Love it. Oh my God, Grace, that is so funny. We need to skin back. This bag skincare routine, guys, we certainly do. Because look at this, it's insane. So cute and tiny. Carl Lagerfeld era. Can you believe this? Perfect, perfect evening bag. You can easily throw it over your shoulder, wear a crossbody. And guys, just like Grace said, red is our biggest color for fall. I mean, fashion, but make it, uh, what do you call that? Fashion, but make it, data, but make it fashion. That's it. Come on. It basically, we saw that cherry red has an uptake of over like 30 something percent or 258% in search results. So cherry red, basically with all black, all like monotone looks, but a cherry red, which is one of Coco Chanel's favorite colors, cherry red, beige, black, and navy. You got it right here. And yes, it's perfect for the CFDAs, the Council of Fashion Designers Americas. So their color is black, white, and red. I keep clicking, I'll stop clicking. Just so excited for it. A beautiful piece. Once again, this is a great piece. You can hold by the chain, easily go like that, simply. Or, as you saw, the chain was on the inside. Bring it to the inside, you guys. And you can make it a gorgeous clutch. This would have gone with anyone's outfit last night. Honestly, so perfect. Beautiful piece, right? Just stunning. And we saw Coco Rocha there. So many beautiful people. Yeah, I'm gonna butcher this. Emily Rodzikowski. Emily Rodzikowski. <laughs> you know what I'm trying to say. Gwyneth. Gwyneth Paltrow was there last night. You guys know I love a Gwyneth moment. She actually was in the bathroom and sent like a photo. I think it was before she went. And it was her in her like jumpsuit, her black jumpsuit. And she goes, skirt or no skirt? And Lily was walking with heels on, like no skirt. And then she's like, I decided the skirt. She was so chic. Literally, I love because they like said who she was wearing. But I guess they, I'm sure her stuff was just her own things. But all it said was Jimmy Choo heels and De Beers jewelry. De Beers jewelry, guys, is like hundreds of thousands of dollars. It's insane. And only Gwyneth Paltrow. Only Gwyneth. We love it. Okay, guys. Next piece. Because we got to bring out a little new Dior and a little old Dior for you, okay? So, the new Dior item that I'm bringing out is the cute, most iconic Dior item we know of right now, besides the saddlebag, that's vintage technically, is the book toe. And this is kind of vintage technically too, but it didn't come out yet. So this is the Christian Dior multicolor embroidered canvas book toe in the size mini. Beautiful, beautiful piece. This is from the 2000 and I believe it's, I want to say 20. I'm going to say 2021. Ooh, I was so close. 2021 collection is $3,450 for this beautiful, beautiful piece. Stunning, right? Absolutely incredible. We love Dior and this one, I mean, this has every color for fall and for spring. It's insane. And guys, if you wanna shop it, head over to amazon.com slash what goes around comes around. Oh, Key Shaking, love your sweater. Where can I get mines at? Great question, Key Shink. I got this question many times already, guys. So this basically is a Ralph Lauren polo bear sweater. I have had this since it kind of came out. This collection It's like a few years old. I think it was like 2000. I, I, do I dare say 2018 when this collection came out? But it's basically the polar bear with the martini. And then you even have like uh, the little tuxedo. So I would have worn him, like his outfit would have been my outfit for the CFDAs. 
um, the other night, but uh, it's Ralph Lauren. Where did I get it from? I got it from Ralph Lauren, duh. <laughs> and so it's like my favorite sweater, but I've not seen them anywhere ever since. I mean, they come out with them, they've done like the ski one, everything, but this one's so hard to get. So key shaking, I think the best place you have to get it is on the pre-love market or Ralph Lauren may come out with it again. I feel like the only person I've seen wear this is Kris Jenner. So me and Chris, hey boo boo. All right, so guys, this piece, $3,450. This was designed by Maria Grazia Chiari in 2018. It actually came out during the spring, summer 2018 collection, the book tote. And then the mini version that we see here came out later. So she was actually inspired by a design she found in the archives, which was created by Mark Bowen, who was creative director and took over Dior after Yves Saint Laurent got drafted into the French Algerian War. French Algerian War. There we go. Got it. I'm gonna stop clicking. I need to stop clicking. <laughs> $3,450. And one of my favorite things about this bag, along with what an Hermes GJ is, is that completely hardwareless. There's no hardware on this bag anywhere. And that's what I love about it. $3,450 for this beautiful piece. You know, the classic Christian Dior. I love it's all basically hand done with embroidery. Insane, right? Insane, guys. And you get the brand tagging right there as well. Beautiful piece. $3,450. I've not been able to see this piece again in this collection. It's one of the very first times I've seen it in this colorway, and it's absolutely insane. So now, Let's move on to a vintage Dior. So Maria Grazia Curie. And now, do I have for you guys a surprise? This is a John Galliano design. He's the one who originally came out with the saddlebag. So this is the Christian Dior vintage green camouflage coated canvas saddle mini bag. It's like the perforated coated canvas from the year 2000. So the saddlebag actually first debuted in 2000, but it was first created in 1999 because the shows are always like a year ahead. But beautiful piece. And of course you have my, one of my other favorite materials, Velcro. Ooh, the sound of Velcro makes me shiver, you guys. It's that good. Mm, we live for it. If you guys haven't been here before, I get a little too excited about handbags in the best way possible. <laughs> Gorgeous green. Green, sorry, dark green, satin interior, zip pocket, and then look, my favorite thing is zipper pull. You have the CD zipper pull here, guys. There's virtually nowhere to it. This is the mini size. I love this. Now, most of the time, authenticity trick. For the vintage ones, the new ones normally have the double hinge. The vintage ones only have the hinge at, I believe, the D. Was it the D or the C? One of the two, but they only have one hinge. So, but this is not always true. It's only, it's normally the rule, but there are exceptions, and this is a great way to show the exception. So you have the gorgeous, gorgeous CD logo, and look, you get that ombre glitter effect. It's very camo-like. Beautiful. Slip pocket with a magnet in the back, but guys, this is a great piece to bring to the CFDAs, because look, you can hide out. Camouflage yourself and hide out from everyone else. You're just there to get your award. Like the Olsen twins did. They've won Accessory Designer Year of the Award again. Congratulations, ladies. And they weren't even there, and I'm obsessed with them for that. So, <laughs> maybe they were there just in camouflage. They had the Dior saddlebag that camouflaged them in the size mini. $6,150. This piece is so insane. And guys, we get some of the best saddlebags here. I mean, we have the Cadillac version, we even have the Rastafarian one. We get them. Oh, they're so rare and hard to find, but here what goes around comes around. We got them for you guys. $6,150 for this beautiful piece. Once again, it's hard to find them anywhere else in the pre-love market, and especially in this great condition. Only here. Only here. $6,150 for this beautiful piece. Now you're probably saying, Mason, I want to go to the CFDAs, but I want to be a little more classic. I got you, all right? I understand. I, you know, I love the fun over the top for events, especially. Normally, I'm a minimalist. Slowly becoming out of that a little bit <laughs> since I've been here because, ooh, I just love bags. But normally, I'm like a minimalist design. But every now and then, I love to go over the top. So this is going back to the minimalist roots, roots for those who love it as well. Very simple, very sleek piece. And this piece is below 1000 this is the Fendi Red Zucchino Canvas Clutch. See, even I just got a little more lower my excitement. It's beautiful here. 
Beautiful item. Oh, Levi Brody, Levi, we actually have Levi's here. We hear what goes around comes around. I have a whole vintage denim bar in all three of our locations in Beverly Hills and two in Soho, which is in the neighborhood in New York City. So tons of vintage Levi's. We actually have the world record for the most expensive Levi's ever sold. We're in Ripley's, believe it or not. So believe it or not. <laughs> so amazing piece, but we love it. We're all for it. $895 for this beautiful piece. We love the Zucchino here as well. So the FF print, which stood for Fun Fur or Fun Fendi, is of course a beautiful piece that was designed in a print that was designed by Karl Lagerfeld in 1965 when he took over Helm at Fendi. So I love to call it Fun Fendi now instead of Fun Fur, but beautiful gold, gorgeous gold here. It's stunning, right? Absolutely stunning. Oh, Levi, can I join? Maybe next time, Levi. Ask me again after a couple martini cocktails off my shirt. <laughs> a beautiful piece here. And I love it because look, you have that thin chain shoulder strap, which makes it perfect for elegant evenings. You can also take it off if you want. Beautiful red as well, that cherry red again. It's so perfect for especially the holidays coming up, but for any event. Red leather trim. And then you have the red satin interior. This does fit an iPhone Max. We tested that as well. And guess what? The best part is this part does come off. Almost there. There we go. So I'm just going to open up a little bit. Beautiful. Look at that. Slip pocket as well. If it's a phone, a card, a lipstick, or a lip gloss, anything you may need, just the essentials for the evening. It is perfect. And look, you can even throw the chain inside if you want, or fully take it off. Just take it off on either end. But it's so perfect. I love that metal frame. It dresses it up a little bit, makes it so much more fun. I love this. $895. I mean, you just can't beat that, guys. Below a thousand. So if you want this piece, head over to Amazon.com slash what goes around comes around. You can easily just pick it out. Good to go. You'll see it. You'll see me right there when you log on. Scroll down. Just, just one little scroll past the gorgeous woman going like this. She's going like this with the bag. Scroll down there, you'll see me, and all the items will right be there as well as the carousel. So let's be right there at the front. So it's perfect. All right, let's bring out the next piece, guys. Next, I have something from the Gucci Alessandro Mistral Spring Summer 2016. So if you want to be like Nicole Kidman, who's not ready to wear the big parrot dress, you can wear the parrot bag. Ooh, take a look at this piece, guys. I'm gonna take a sip of water real quick. I'll be right back. All right, guys, I am back. That was quick, that was fast, done and done and done. This is the Gucci Purple Gigi Embroidered Supreme Canvas Dionysus bag in the size medium with gorgeous feathers. It is, I mean, it's the parrot design. Nicole Kidman wore the parrot version dress, which had the parrots on either side and the feathers coming out. But here we have it in the bag version. Gorgeous suede, as you can see here. And only here what goes around comes around are you going to find this amazing feather detail as well and the beautiful embroidery. I love this. Gorgeous embroidery onto the clasp here, which actually that clasp was originally designed by Tom Ford. So beautiful. But here, the, instead of the dragons, we have the roaring tigers. Stunning, right? Spring, summer 2016. $2,950. And you can open this up. Look at this. Gorgeous purple suede interior. You even get the embroidery here as well. Slip pocket. Gorgeous double pocket with a zipper on the inside as well. I love this. Such a chic piece. $2,950. Easily can clasp it just like that. Look at that. So fun and easy. $2,950. There we go. Boom. Incredible, right? Incredible. Spring, summer 2016, and the Dionysus bag was actually named after the god of wine in Roman and Greek mythology. So this is the perfect bag to bring to any festivities like the CFDA Awards. So this is perfect for it. $2,950 for this incredible item. All right, 
Next, I have for you guys this gorgeous and amazing piece, which is so vintage. You're reminding people why you're in fashion. You're like, I've been there since the heyday, since Marc Jacobs' heyday. And even if you weren't, shh, you can pretend a little bit, right? And this bag will help you. This bag will give you your credibility you need. This is the Louis Vuitton monogram vinyl and Tweety Rabat with gold hardware. This is from the Louis Vuitton Fall Winter 2003 collection. And it was actually look number 25 on the runway via VogueRunway.com. So how much fun to hit people with that information? Or you know it, maybe you're at the CFDAs and you're like, love your bag. Fall Winter 20, 2003, look 25, Marc Jacobs, killer. And just keep on going, say nothing more. Just keep going. That's one of my favorite tricks to do. Whenever I see someone with their bag, I just say it to them, I'm like, beautiful, and I just move on. Move on, one of my favorite party tricks. Beautiful piece, look at this. I love the robot. It's so simple and easily can fit over your shoulder. And I love the CFDAs, it's kind of cool because you can really wear whatever you want. It's the one time someone would appreciate if you wore an amazing full denim outfit. You know, people aren't gonna be like, well, where's your red carpet look? This is the time where you can really pull out your fashion looks and the fashion lovers are all there, so they're all gonna understand. A like beautiful Vachetta trim for being from 2003, insane condition. And I love that you get this vinyl monogram canvas instead of, so it's a printed on there rather than just a coated canvas. It's that beautiful vinyl monogram. And then you also have this gorgeous tweed below it. So stunning vinyl, look at that. Beautiful. Gorgeous, gorgeous tweed as well. Oh my God, guys, 3,000 likes, thank you all so much. You guys, if you wanna shop these items, oh my God, look, more tweed, more tweed, I'm obsessed. Sorry, cut myself off. If you wanna shop these items, head over to amazon.com slash what goes around comes around and you'll be here with us. Beautiful vinyl underneath and you're gonna die. This is number 1,038. So guys, that means that there was a limited production. This could have been the last one. 1,038 could have been it. You never know. But beautiful piece. Look at that old contra lining. Slip pocket, there's no wear. Beautiful piece. Guys, and this Vachetta trim. I love the metal corners. I mean, can't get over it. And look at that tweed as well. Everything in great condition. It does lock, has that kiss lock to mal lock. Very indicative of the Louis Vuitton trunks. And look, comes with the original dust bag. And I think, and it does, oh my God, you guys, only here what goes around comes around. Are we gonna also bring you the original booklet, the monogram tweed booklet, and no, the original tag as well, the original UPC code, insane. Only here what goes around comes around, guys. I mean, here we're gonna to try to bring you all the accoutrements, everything attached with this piece, and I mean, we kill it every time. I literally am sometimes my breath is taken away with how just incredible we are at doing this. Like. Honestly, no other place have worked. I've been in this industry for like almost 10 years now and been at many places and hear what goes around comes around every single time. Best condition out there, authenticity guaranteed. Never have to worry about a thing and look at this, just beautiful all the way around. And of course, it's gonna try to bring you the original piece. So they, they know you missed it. So they wanna bring you, give you that second life. This is insane. Let's see what they say about the monogram Tweety. We recommend you observe the following instructions so you can enjoy your bag for many years. Steven Louis Vuitton wants it. Through time, tweed threads may slightly come out. The phenomenon, phenomenon is inherent to the material. So I love that. It's just like it's telling you all the information. Monogram Tweety, we love it. There's a lot more information in French. It's taking me a minute to translate. Yeah, I can't translate that for you guys right now, but later. <laughs> all right? <laughs> okay. Beautiful piece, once again, guys, $2,950. Monogram Tweety came out fall, winter 2003, look number 25 on the runway, so don't miss out on it, guys. In this condition, number 1,038, insane, insane. All right, next I have for you guys the perfect little mini bag for the CFDA occasion. Ah, look at her. This is the Yves Saint Laurent Rive Gauche. So this is from Yves Saint Laurent era before. Heidi Slomane took over and made it, um, what do you call it? Made it Saint Laurent Paris. <laughs> I love it. Saint Laurent Satin Muse Mini. 
beautiful piece. Oh my God, Grace is so right, guys. I only speak handbag French. My French is non-existent unless it's for handbags. So <laughs> beautiful piece here. But the Yves Saint Laurent Muse bag, which I love, two different purples here. You can see the Y coming up for the Eves. Slightly darker with a lighter satin around it as well. So this was introduced by Stefano Pilotti in 2005, and it was actually first released in February 2006. So basically, the East Saint Laurent Muse bag was the first it bag they had. So Fendi kind of created that it bag kind of style, that like first kind of phenomenon we all needed the it bag, the Fendi baguettes. Then each brand had their own, and Yves Saint Laurent finally had theirs in 2006 with the Muse bag. So they made this in different sizes, but this is one of the rarest ones you can find is the satin version with all the crystals. And then to go as far as finding all the crystals intact, truly only here at what goes around comes around will you find this in this grade of condition. Guys, I've seen these go for $3,000 plus with, a with even this missing, with the crystals missing, the lock missing here, but only here. Now look, you can get the little Y on the clochette here. It's just a little key ring. My finger is too big to pull it out, but <laughs> I don't want to damage it. Beautiful base here, just a little bit of creasing. Four feet on the base. You know, I'm gonna go ahead and pull it out. I can do it, guys. We can do it. See, oh look, I'm doing it perfectly without harming it. There we go. Beautiful key ring. I would not recommend using it just because you want to keep it in great condition because the keys will wear up against the silk and we don't want that to happen. Now the interior, you guys. You're not gonna believe this interior. This interior is so stunning. It's a beautiful gold kind of just, you know, curry yellow, gorgeous satin, $1,750. Remember guys, I told you, I've seen these pieces go for $3,000 plus on the pre-love market and not this great of condition and not with the original clochette or with crystals intact. Only here would we literally look at every single space on it and find that amazing, amazing crystals, make sure they're all there intact. Now there's nowhere to the space just creasing. That's just a little bit of dust that we're wiping off right there. Perfect. $1,750, guys, for this beautiful, beautiful piece. Absolutely incredible. Incredible, incredible item. $1,750. I mean, honestly, this would have been such a good piece for, I'm thinking, hey, honestly, not for Gwyneth. The Hilton sisters were there. They were there. This would have been perfect for Nikki because Kathy, their mom, has this bag in black, so it could have been like, you know, mom-daughter bags for Nikki or for Paris. I feel like this is more Nikki than Paris. Someone's just like, tell me that. Or if Kathy was there, Kathy could have easily used this. Beautiful piece. Once again, this piece is $1,750. Such a steal for this item. I mean, just can't get over it. Cannot get over it. And then, guys, now, we are in the fashion industry still, and what happens in the fashion industry? Many of us, we're still running late. We still have to work that day, even though the CFDAs are that night. So the perfect piece to do both in, to achieve both, is this beautiful wallet on chain right here. I'm gonna show you how. So this little typo in our title, this is not actually the, Cher, the Chanel Paris Shanghai black canvas CC stud wall on chain. It's actually from the pre-fall 2019 collection, which is Paris, New York. So beautiful denim here, the black denim, and then you actually have the CC studs on there, kind of cool. So the pre-fall New York collection is actually very Egyptian themed, but has some of this amazing studding, kind of graffiti look to it. So I love this piece, black and silver studding. Gorgeous, gorgeous lambskin. Now there is some press marks just from the zipper, and that's gonna happen over time no matter what. But beautiful piece, slip pocket, zip pocket, another slip compartment here, and then eight credit card slots, leather woven chain. This is the wallet on chain or the walk as the handbag collecting community calls it. Now this, the walk first came out in 1997, designed by Karl Lagerfeld, of course. I call it the bag that fits everyone, the sisterhood of the traveling bag, but you don't have to share it. So it hits that golden ratio between, you know, your chest and your hip, and even could hit your hip a little bit as well, and that's perfect. But this is great because like I said, many of us in the fashion industry, like me here, we all work crazy hours and it's for the love of this clothing and the love to bring it to you guys and we're obsessed with it. So part of that is we may have to still work the day of the CFDAs. So we gotta run to make the event, we're getting ready at work and you may have forgotten your clutch. Oh no, what do I do? I gotcha. Beautiful piece right here 
and you're running to the CFDH because you're going to be late. So you're running, running, running. So you can wear this crossbody while you're running. And then you can easily just pop this into your bag. And look, now it's an elegant evening clutch. Boom, just like that. Did I blow your guys' mind? Because I blew my own mind. And look, if you don't want it that side, boom. Bigger CC just on the other side. Chic again, right there. And then you tell everyone, you know, it's that, what's that mean? It's like, oh my God, look at this shirt. I got it for like $3. It's amazing. No one's going to know I got it for $3. And then someone goes, nice shirt. Thanks, $3. That's all we ever do. So amazing. Some people be this and be like, wow, I love your clutch. Thanks. It's actually a wallet on chain. Like that's what I would do. I'd be that person. Be like, I'm hiding all of my mysteriousness and just letting everyone know about it. With this piece, $4,500 is a limited edition piece, no longer in production, but I love it. You get all the CCs and you can even turn around while wearing it, just have the one CC to make it look like that original timeless one from 1997. So a beautiful piece. Once again, $4,500, no longer in production, silver, and of course, black, like dark gray, studding on it. Incredible piece, incredible piece. Now guys, if you want to also impress them, with another amazing kind of item from Chanel. Not only do we have the boy bag, which is such a classic, this boy bag is one that was here and gone in moments. It is, of course, the top handle boy bag. I mean, you never see these anymore. When you do, they're basically destroyed because people just fall in love with them, like we do here, as you see here. This is the Chanel red quilted caskin top handle boy bag in the size medium with antique gold hardware. This piece is from 2017 to 2018 era. So only $6,950. Incredible, right guys? Absolutely incredible. Look, virtually nowhere you get what this is here actually, that Lux Ling from the mid 2000s chain. This is a re-edition of that. Isn't that amazing? Where basically the chain has the quilting around it or the leather around it. So instead of it being a leather woven chain strap, it's a chain leather woven, a leather chain woven strap. That's what I'm trying to say. Oh, that almost could have came out on me so perfectly, but my brain didn't let it happen. So that's okay. We get on the top handle here as well on the back here. And I love to even stop it here to mimic the front there. The beautiful piece. I love opening the boy bag and showing you guys the full back. Because I think it's important to show, look at all that beautiful quilting like that there. Beautiful goes all the way down. To show that's just one piece. That is amazing craftsmanship. That is all just that one piece right there. Beautiful interior. Look at this. Virtually nowhere, just some minor, minor markings. You still get that classic boy strap here, but instead of it being the adjustable one, it's just that classic shoulder. So I love it. It becomes almost like an evening boy bag, which I love. And then, of course, you can easily wear it like this. And look, even my hand fit through, guys. So great. $6,950 for this beautiful, beautiful item. Look at that interior. Beautiful, beautiful canvas interior with a slip pocket. This piece, $6,950. I mean, you just can't beat that. I mean, this is no longer in production. 2017, 2018 collection. You get that handle on top, which I love. You can put the chain on the inside and you're all set. Once again, such a hot color for fall, this beautiful red. This is like a little darker than a normal cherry red, but it's still beautiful, right? $6,950 for this piece. All right. Now I have some sequin dreams for you guys that I'm excited to bring out. This is the Chanel I mean, Chanel is just an amazing thing to bring to any event, guys. Am I right? Chanel gray, black, houndstooth, sequin half flap in the size medium from 2020-2021. This piece is $9,950. You guys, look at it. It's like a disco ball. It's so much fun. It's so fabulous. Now look at this. This is kind of like an in-between a medium and a jumbo, in my opinion, just from a sizing standpoint. But it is, of course, well, first off, look at that houndstooth lining up, even in sequins. Chanel lines it up. It is a single flap. We don't see the single flaps or them doing the hardware like this anymore. Only here are we going to find it. This piece is no longer in production. Amazing item. 
gorgeous. I just, I can't get over this. Like, I'm just breathless, speechless. Not breathless, I mean, I can't breathe either because it's so beautiful. But it comes with the felt protector and of course a Chanel dust bag along with a complimentary what goes around comes around dust bag. Plastic is still in the hardware up here. Beautiful black satin line interior. Slip pocket, Chanel logo. We love it. Zip pocket up top here. Very indicative of the original single flat bag style. Gorgeous ruthenium hardware, the shiny ruthenium. So shiny ruthenium is basically modeled after the periodic table of elements where the chemical ruthenium in its solid form actually looks like kind of shiny graphite, if you will. So it's like, you know, very shiny, a beautiful dark, dark, dark gray, almost black. So I love like a pewter color. And then Chanel also has their antique silver, which they call ruthenium as well. But this piece, beautiful, look at this on. You can wear it crossbody, you can even wear it as a clutch if you want to. Gorgeous sequins. I mean, you just can't beat this piece. $9,950, it's just honestly iconic. I'm obsessed with it. Beautiful piece. I just can't go over the black satin as well. Satin lining, there's just something about satin lining that's just so, Chef's kiss, beautiful guys. $9,950, this piece from 2020, 2021. Absolutely incredible, cannot get over it. Beautiful, beautiful piece. $9,950, stunning. Now guys, get ready. I'm about to bring you metallic galore. Literally, I'm not joking, metallic after metallic after metallic, I was saving this for like, the middle is just towards the end, and here we are. We're not even more near the end. Still got 40 minutes left of me and these bags. So the first one I'm going to bring out mm, is a gold metallic. Guys, it's so rare we found a second one of these. This one already sold, the original one we had, and now we were able to find a second, which is so impossible to do. But what goes around comes around. We make the impossible possible. This is the Chanel Gold Wave Quilted Lambskin Clutch with beautiful gold bijou hardware. It's from the 91-94 era, so this is gearing up on 30 years in age. Beautiful bijou hardware here. So that's CC hardware there that's quilted in there. They call that bijou. 24 karat plated gold. It's no longer in existence. They even actually came out with a slightly newer version, but it's not that 24 karat plated gold. CC turn lock more beautiful wave quilting underneath. And guys, remember how hard it is to do this wave quilting, to do it on a curve, almost impossible. Only Chanel and their artisans could do this. Slip pocket in the back. Beautiful, beautiful gold interior with a slip pocket and a zip pocket. CC medallion zipper. We love this. This piece only $4,000, you guys. These pieces normally go close of $5,000 plus, but here what goes around comes around in this grade of condition, only 4,000 USD. Remember, head over to amazon.com slash what goes around comes around if you wanna shop this item. It is so beautiful and perfect. And guys, remember, feel free to follow us as well. Hit that follow button when you're there so you don't miss out on a show or these amazing items. I mean, why would you? You're not gonna miss out on a moment of moi, my beautiful self. This is, once again, 91 to 94. Beautiful piece. I mean, look at this on. Easily wears a little clutch. I mean, even the Ralph Lauren Polo Martini Bear agrees. $4,000, beautiful piece. Will go with anything. I love it. Metallic's a neutral in my mind. It truly is. Truly, truly is a neutral. Now, guys, we have this beautiful piece here. This is actually embossed. Beautiful item. This is the Chanel Gray Embossed Snakeskin Quilted Clutch. I love this piece from 2014, $3,950, but I love it. Satin lining, this isn't metallic, but the metallic satin lining interior. And it's like, it's like a faux snakeskin, so it's almost like a satin lining. So this is beautiful, and this is also great, especially if you like travel abroad and you wanna bring like an exotic bag. You have to be careful because some places don't always allow ex certain exotics, they have different rules. So some places may allow that skin, some don't. This is a great way around it, is the embossed, but still Chanel. And all of Chanel pieces since 2018 on are now all embossed items. They no longer do exotics, but we do have exotics if you guys want it. So 
amazon.com slash what goes around comes around or DM us at what goes around NYC and at WGACA live or feel free to DM me or Grace directly as well at Mason Henry Howell at ideal.grace. There we go. And we'll be happy to connect you with one of our stylists who can find you a perfect exotic bag. But you can also get this piece, which is perfect for any events, especially if you travel around. Vienna has that amazing costume ball there. And then, of course, if you have to come back to New York for the CFBAs, and then who knows, you go back abroad over to Paris and then London. So many amazing fun events. But this piece would be perfect for it. So elevated and gorgeous. $3,950. For this beautiful piece. You don't have to pay the price of an exotic, right? Incredible. From 2014, $3,950 for this beautiful, beautiful item. All right. And then next, this is a real exotic match I'm going to bring out to you. But you guys remember that little Grippois barrel bag I showed you, right? I am ready to bring you guys the next amazing iteration of the barrel bags. Let me get out my gloves. My beautiful gloves, I don't want those ones. I want these ones. I put on the black gloves earlier that were too tiny for my hands, and I was like, oh no. I need my marching band gloves. No joke, these are marching band gloves. High quality cotton, only here. And what goes around comes around. Can my giant self have to wear marching band gloves? <laughs> Amazing, okay. All right, here we have this beautiful, insane, gorgeous, vintage. Once again, just like our Gripois, this is a Chanel 1986-1988 dark green lizard barrel bag with quilting. CC logo, $4,850. Absolutely stunning, just like the piece we had before. You have the green leather tonal that is, of course, trimming the bag. It does look a little lighter than the normal exotic, but that is because these all take different kind of, you know, very, very different, what am I trying to say? Different uh, technique. When they dye it, it takes it on the, the dye a little different. So it's beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful. Oh, Jessica, one of my friends DM Mason on Insta and Mason replied, she was very happy. Oh, Jessica, welcome in, Jessica. Great to see you. Yes, guys, I do actually respond to all of you guys. I adore you all. I love talking about bags. It's all what we're here for. So feel free to DM me if you just want to say hi, talk about the bags. I got you guys. But 1986 to 88, $4,850 for this beautiful, beautiful bag. Beautiful. Oh, Jessica, Althea, oh, wonderful. Yeah, she sent me some hearts and said hello. Love it, love. Yeah, she said uh, my streams were amazing. She loved them. So if you guys want to DM me that all day long, I'm not going to say, say no. <laughs> But guys, once again, $4,850 for this piece. Look at this, still in that beautiful shine, that Lise look. It is beautiful barrel bag, very 60s mod, but this is an 86 to 88 production. So guys, it's over 35 years in age. Beautiful piece. Of course, it has that gorgeous tonal interior. Actually, a black interior, beautiful part of me. Zipper pocket, of course, Chanel logo still in there. And once again, guys, you can wear this as just like the little shoulder bag that it is. Or, you know my favorite thing to do, go like this, wrap it up, boom, just like that. Such a great little side bag, I almost said side piece. You know, to each other, maybe bring your side piece to the CFDAs. <laughs> and then, if you want to make it a clutch, you certainly can. Look at that. And I love that CC logo is like barely visible. Once again, for those who know, they will know. They'll probably notice the tassel first, but such a cool piece. You can wear this in multiple different ways. Over your shoulder, you can wear it crossbody if you're small enough. I'm six foot five, so it won't go crossbody. I mean, it will, but it'll be like up to here. And then a clutch, you can also just wear it as like a little like chain handle, top handle. So cute, $4,850 for an exotic lizard piece from Chanel. I mean, say no more. Add to cart, you know where you guys can add to cart? Amazon.com slash what goes around comes around or what goes around nyc.com as well. It's so cool, guys. It's such an amazing piece. We love it. All right, now let's get ready for all the metallic silvers. That's right, I brought you guys, I think, three different metallic silver bags. Let's get into it. First one. 
And of course, they're all mini. Why wouldn't they be? <laughs> this is the mini Chanel metallic silver leather top handle mini bag from 96 to 97. This is $6,500 for this beautiful, beautiful piece. I absolutely love it. 24 karat plated gold hardware here as well. Beautiful flap top handle here. Gorgeous piece. Look at that. I love it. And then metallic silver interior continues all the way around. Very like ice queen, but I love it. And then I love that they did the gold hardware, 24 karat plated gold hardware, that two tone. I don't know why it dresses it up and makes it just chic and so fun. Smooth leather, the whole thing's leather except for that little, you honestly have like one, two, three, four pieces of hardware, five with a zipper, 24 karat plated gold. And look at that little zip pocket there. Guys, finding metallic in this great of condition, especially being from 96 to 97 era, this piece only $6,500. Such an incredible price for this piece, you guys. Insane, look at this, smooth leather. Once again, it's so hard to find pieces over 20 years in age in this great of condition, especially for metallic. It's such a gorgeous item. Now, let me bring out to you guys another amazing piece. This is the 91 to 94. I, guys, I'm telling you, I'm bringing you a, a triage of gorgeous, gorgeous Chanel items in metallic. And guys, remember, these are the perfect pieces to wear to the CFDAs, any event, $6,500. And now we have this beautiful Chanel metallic silver envelope flat bag in the size mini. Gorgeous, look at that. You see all the crystals in there? Only hear what goes around comes around. Are you going to find all those crystals intact? For this bag being 30 years plus in age. Magnetic closure as well. And look, you get that diagonal quilting, you get the whole bit of horizontal quilting, you get it all. Look at that. And I love, even when you lay this flat, it still matches up. It covers just that one area. Beautiful. And it continues on that beautiful stream. Now look at this. You can easily wear this as just a simple clutch or all right, slip pocket. You can also wear it as a chain bag. And the chain does come off. But look how cute that is. I mean, it's just so precious. Honestly, if any other color, would not be a fan, but metallic silver, killing it, killing it. It's making it look more modern. It's making it look not only just vintage, but it's making it not look dated vintage. That's one thing we don't do here is we're iconic vintage of what goes around comes around, not dated vintage. <laughs> you love that? Oh my God, is that our new slogan? Iconic vintage, not dated. Coin and coin, done and done. Beautiful piece. Once again, this piece. $4,950. I mean, say no more. Say no more. And look how beautiful and dainty that chain is. But it's not so dainty that it's going to break. It is just perfectly strong. It's a very strong chain. Its thickness is just the right amount, but it still has that iconic evening kind of look to it. $4,950 for this beautiful piece. I mean, just can't beat it, right? Guys, we're not done with the metallics. I have one more metallic silver piece to show you. And we're going to see them all together because why not? The next piece I have is slightly newer. And who else like loves just a minimalistic design? I want to hear from you guys. I'm all for a sleek minimalist look, especially with what I'm about to show you. There we go. Stay there cuties because this piece, this is so fun. This is giving like Bottega mixed with Kate and then Chanel on top of it. This is the Chanel metallic silver Caskin envelope flap reissue roll clutch. I love this. So metallic silver quilted leather reissue clutch. I think I threw a little bit of this bag's name in there. Guys, I've been going straight for almost 90 minutes. So woohoo, going a lot up in there. <laughs> but I love this, the roll clutch. 2012 is when this piece came out. Beautiful, beautiful antique silver hardware as well. And I love this roll part. So the roll doesn't come undone because it has that stitch right there. Beautiful piece. So it's like a classic reissue flat bag, but you get the top as a clutch part. Stunning metallic silver interior, zip pocket as well. The serial code is still intact. This piece, $4,450. Beautiful. And I love, you still get that classic CC pocket there. 
And I love it's like an aged metallic silver as well. So you can easily throw this under your arm. You can wear it as a top of the world clutch, but this works for perfect for any event. And honestly, all of them do. Now this piece is only $4,450. I'm all about a reissue. I love the CC turn lock, the, CC, the Mademoiselle turn lock, my apologies, because this was actually the original turn lock Coco Chanel created, was the Mademoiselle turn lock. And then Carl Lagerfeld is actually the one who brought the CC logo to the exterior of the bag. All right, come on, we've got this, guys. Is this gonna look as cute as I think it is? Oh, it's not. I tried, guys, I really, really tried there. But guys, remember, $6,500 for this cutie, $4,950 for this cutie, and for this baby right here, $4,450. So you have your choice in metallic bags for your evening bags, especially for the CFDA awards. I mean, you got it right there. Honestly, Anne Hathaway looked amazing. Honestly, everyone looked amazing last night. There was no one I was like, eh, I hated that. I loved them all. And so many amazing like winners as well. So I love it. So chic. Okay, guys, next I have a few more amazing Chanel bags for you guys. And I have a couple Louis before we end it. Don't you worry. Don't you worry about some Louis too. But Chanel just, it makes an evening statement sometimes, you guys. It really, really does. And I had that beautiful Kelly Pochette in the beginning. We had some Hermes in there. Now, guys, this piece is from the Chanel Spring Summer 1997 collection. This was on the runway. There's also a Lucite version of this, but this piece, $8,950 the mini box bag with gold hardware. This is insane. Spring, summer, 1997. I love this piece. It's all acrylic with just metal. The logo's right there. I love it, almost like a jewelry piece. Completely online, just in acrylic. Beautiful piece, look at that. Stunning. Most of the time you see these fully broken or complete nicks taken out of it, but only here what goes around comes around. Are you gonna find it in this condition? Now I know there's some scratching to it, some fingerprints, which is why we're wearing gloves. You get the snake chain here. But well, let me tell you, like this piece for this acrylic bag, especially being 26 years in age, insane to find it like this. I mean, this is the perfect evening bag. You would, don't have to look any further. This is it. And look, and I love even if you're just holding it, like it's just so chic. Just hold, very like Kim K, I feel like she would wear this. $8,950, guys. This is designed by Carl Lagerfeld. Walk down the runway. Amazing, amazing piece. I've seen these go at auction for 10,000 plus, so only $8,950. Very much of the Andy era. You're so right, Grace. Absolutely beautiful piece, guys. Insane. Now remember, guys, if you want to shop these items, head over to amazon.com slash what goes around comes around or what goes around nyc.com. You can shop all these items and say hello to us, the handbag hangout crew. We have Rachel, Isabel, Jessica, Avery, where have you been? Avery, Stephanie, we all have here. Melissa, I believe, has joined us now. So I gotta sit over there, guys. All right, guys, once again, this piece, $8,950 for this beautiful, beautiful item. Now, let's bring out our next piece. Next, I have for you guys, is this cutie. This is a Chanel black chocolate bar clutch. Now, this is so funny because the chocolate bar collection, which was designed by Karl Lagerfeld, when it first came out, I gotta shake that chain back a little bit. There we go. <laughs> when it first came out, it's actually kind of amazing because it is basically just a diamond quilting, but put as a square. So I love that. When Karl Lagerfeld saw it, he was like, ho, 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 looks like a chocolate bar. You know, very much in his German sense of humor. So I love that here, but this is, the East West single flat bag in a size medium from 2000, 2002. Chocolate bar is no longer in production and the East West collection is no longer in production either. So the only place to get it is on the pre-love market. And look, you can see the quilting still matches up all the lines perfectly. We see here, I love that kind of brushed gold hardware here. It's stunning, 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 stunning. Love, love, love. Oh, Jessica, we love you. Thank you so much for tuning in, Jessica. Sending our love to you, and that is to everyone out there. Sending you guys the best. Now look at this beautiful piece on the interior. Gorgeous, three slip pockets there. One for just, you know, 
beautiful. Like you can put your lipstick there or anything. Two slip pockets as well. Beautiful. So Coco Chanel originally designed those to keep your lipstick and then your compact and your cash. But now you can really put anything you want in there. And look, you can get a little chain strap, easily throw it on, just like that. You can wear it as the clutch. Chain out or chain in. And then look, one side comes off. So you can easily wear it as like a cute little chain bag, but just like gives it a little different. Like Chanel even made the upside down bag as they called it. So here you go, just like that. Super simple. You can throw this over your shoulder. I don't know why I love this look. I was doing it earlier on the same Bart show. It's just something about it, especially with the longer bags. And then if you really wanted to, you can put it on and make it a, uh, a hip bag, you know, a chain bag. Whatever you gotta do with it. Whatever you wanna call that name. <laughs> Beautiful piece, $4,500. Remember guys, no longer in production. And wow, the condition of this piece, Insane, look at that back. All one piece of leather and that beautiful chocolate bar quilting. $4,500. This piece is absolutely incredible. I just, I can't get over it. Beautiful item. And once again, no longer production, except for every now and then you see the limited editions come out. But this piece, beautiful. $4,500. You just can't beat it, you really can't. Great for every evening. This is timeless elegance right here, guys. Absolutely incredible. All right, guys, then the next piece is to really bring out that Y2K side of you is this little pochette. Guys, you don't see these anymore. This is the Chanel Beige Quilted Caskin Cambone Line Pochette with silver hardware. Now the Cambone Line came out in 2004 and it was named after Rue Cambon. 19 Rue Cambon, which was Coco Chanel's very first store. She was originally like a milliner, hat maker. So I love that. Throw it over shoulders. It even fits over my shoulder, so it'll fit over yours fine. Remember, guys, I'm six foot five. So if you're below six five, you'll be fine with this. But I love this piece. You even get a little slip pocket here. I don't know what you can put there. Your love for fashion, your love for the CFDAs. Maybe your little table ticket right there. Stunning, stunning beige caskin. Only here. How it goes around comes around. Are you gonna find beige in this great of condition? $2,950, that has to be a misprice because that is so insane. Oh my gosh, let me check. Wow, yeah, $2,950, you guys. Insane. Such an amazing price for this piece, guys. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Stunning, stunning piece. I just love it. I mean, you cannot beat that. 2005, 2006, you even get the zip interior with that gorgeous CC logo lining and a beautiful zip pocket. You know I love this oversized CC lining here. It's literally my favorite thing in the world. Stunning, stunning piece. Beautiful, right? Absolutely stunning. And look, the patent leather here, guys, is not printed on. This is not sprayed on or anything. This is stitched leather on. Not only is it so hard to make these round edges, but then to curve it again onto the bag at this precision, only Chanel artisans could do something like this. $2,950 for this beautiful, beautiful piece. And look, you can get that classic Chanel slip pocket back there. The Cambone chain, this is a great way to identify the Cambone line. Besides the big CC, the chain. You just have to look at the chain. You know me, the first thing I look at is someone's zipper pull. I'm like, oh, it's that bag. And I'm like, well, I could have just looked at the bag, but where's the fun in that? It's like a little handbag, little handbag fun, kind of a handbag trivia. Skippy, what is the CDFA? So it's CFDAs, close. Whatever, you, you know, you almost got it there. You're almost there. <laughs> CFDAs, yes. So Skippy, that's okay. CFDAs are the Ca Council of Fashion Designer of America's Awards. So basically it is where all the American fashion designers sit abroad or here in America. They all sit on this board basically. The chairman currently is Tom Brown, who's an American fashion designer. And it's basically like fashion in America is like night of the year, it's our Oscars basically. So they honor Serena Williams. She was the fashion style icon of the year. Uh, Kate won Women's Wear Designer Year of the Award. The row, Mary Kate and Asher Olsen won, um, uh, what do you call it, uh, Accessories of the Year Award. And then Vera Wang, she actually wore like 
like iconic award kind of thing. And then Jonathan Anderson, he won international awards. So it's basically just like all amazing things. Kim Kardashian was there, Martha Stewart, of course, uh, Amazon, which we're coming to you guys live from, we partner with. Actually, Amazon Fashion sponsored it, which was so cool and amazing. So we saw the Amazon team there. It's so cool. So we're basically doing like all the bags you could have worn there. And just, you know, anything that's like chic enough to make its way because it's the night you can finally be like CF day. You can be a, uh, what do you call it? It's the night you can finally like wear your fashion stuff and like people who are fashion will get it. You know what I mean? Like if you know, you know kind of thing. It's chic, we love it. It's a club anyone can be a part of. And we're all there to love each other. Speaking of a club everyone loves to be a part of, Hermes, okay? And of course, what goes around comes around live. Am I right? All right, next piece I have for you guys is this stunning, discontinued stunning, Hermes box cap Tundra Midor clutch in the size 29 with beautiful gold hardware. So this hardware is actually called the Calier de Chien, which means dog collar in French. And it was first actually created for dogs when Hermes came out with it in the early 1900s. But then one of their custom clients saw it and was like, I want a belt made out of that. And since then, Calier de Chien has been a huge, huge, basically staple within Hermes jewelry, Hermes bags, and Hermes hardware. So they call it the Madore, this clutch, and sometimes this hardware is just called Madore. So it's basically where this comes up like this, it's a giant strap basically that goes all the way around the bag. That turned to not work whatsoever. But look at that, it's a giant strap that makes this beautiful clutch. This color is called Tundra. This bag from 2008. Now the size 29 Madore clutch was discontinued. Oh my gosh, look at that Chev leather, beautiful. Slip pocket as well. Now Chev is the goat skin. Box cap is a smooth leather that is like Hermes' heritage leather, as they call it, like the very first leather. $4,950. Now they make the smaller version, this 23. Comes with the Hermes dust bag. And don't worry, complimentary. What goes around comes around dust bag. Look at that condition. Insane for being 15 years old. So gorgeous. But this piece, like I said, no longer in production for the size 29. And we love an oversized bag. I mean, big bag fall, you guys. Look at this. Even on me, six foot five, it's such a great bag on me. It's such a great size, very proportionate. So honestly for anyone, and then if you're smaller wearing this, it just gives that oversized kind of fun look. But this is a piece that you wear to the CFDAs. And once again, the fashion people know they're gonna respect it. They're going to understand it, you know? And here's the thing, I love my bags. I love them. And I don't need anyone to give me the validation, just like none of you need the validation. But every now and then, every now and then, I would like a little recognition for my beautiful bag. <laughs> just saying. I'm not gonna hide it or say it at all. I'm just gonna speak the truth. I need a little recognition and it makes my day if someone compliments my bag. It really does. It's so beautiful, $4,950 for this beautiful piece. Gorgeous item, wow. Just killer, honestly killer. All right guys, we just have a few bags left. Now once again, we are still in our vanity era. So the next piece I have for you guys, I'm gonna take a quick sip of water, I promise to be so quick, is this beautiful Louis Vuitton Red, such called Castilian Red, Epi Boite Tout. Beautiful brass hardware. Right. I'm back. Beautiful, right? Oh, Machiavelli, first off, love your name. One of my favorite books, The Prince. Love a Machiavellian. Hey, love the style. Thank you. I'm sure you're talking about the bags, but thank Yo, if you're talking about me, <laughs> appreciate it. But guys, this is the Louis Vuitton Epi Leather. Castilian red is the color, Boite Tout. So basically Boite Tout is a bag that means a box for anything. That's basically what it translates to from French, not to be exact, but in English, it's what it basically means. $2,500, gorgeous brass hardware, based on, ooh, let's watch that, ready? Beautiful. Basically when I've seen this is definitely a 90s era piece. It's so stunning. And look, you even get, you can keep your jewelry in here. Gwyneth can keep her De Beers in here. It's perfect. $2,500 for this piece. 
top handle, but you can also wear it as a cute little evening bag. It's so sane. Now guys, Epi Leather first came out in 1985 and it's had very different variations since then. So as I was talking about earlier, this Epi Leather is horizontal, where the newer Epi Leather under Nicholas Geskier, it's hard to see, is diagonal. Am I doing that the right way? Diagonal, just like that but this is more of a horizontal. So that's like the slight difference in it. So those slight differences, it makes a huge impact on kind of just the style of it. And that's what I love. And that's how we're also able to tell kind of what era this piece is from. So $2,500 for this beautiful piece. Once again, perfect to carry your De Beers in. You wear your De Beers and the next thing you can just wear this as your cute little bag for the evening at the CFDAs. Once again, Icebreaker with Kim Kardashian. She was recently seen in a What Goes Around Comes Around Chanel vanity case that she purchased from us. So it is a beautiful pre-loved item from us that she purchased. It's a beautiful Chanel vanity case in patent leather, wore around New York. You can then wear your vanity case and there's your icebreaker right there. It's so perfect. You guys can bond over wearing vanity bags. It's fantastic. $2,500 for this beautiful, beautiful piece. Let's see that hardware. Let's see that again. Ready? Ready for the clasp? I love it. And that sound too, it's beautiful. Gorgeous. By the way, the interior is tiger leather. So it's more scratch resistant, water resistant, and stain resistant. It's so beautiful and perfect on the inside there. I just, I can't get over it. Stunning, stunning piece. $2,500 for this beautiful item. All right, guys. I have two more items for you guys. The next piece I'm going to bring out is one that Honestly, it was created by another, I mean, he's a Parisian designer, but like also American in a way, you know? Just is, because he loved America. This is something you wear to the CFDAs. This is the Louis Vuitton Azadine Alaya collaboration monogram leopard Alma. So guys, this piece is from 1996. This has to be, hands down, one of my favorite pieces out there. So this piece basically was released in the 100th anniversary honor of monogram coated canvas being released. So fun fact, monogram coated canvas came out in 1996 and actually Dimier, the checkerboard, predates that in 1888. But basically the 100th anniversary, they called the Centier. So this is the 1896-1996 edition Centier collection. And basically seven different bags were designed or reimagined by seven of the like, top designers in 1996. So, the first one was Sibilla, the second one Azadine Alaya, as we see here, Vivian Westwood, Manola Blahnik, Helmut Lane, Romeo Gigli, and of course Isaac Mizrahi. So those were the seven designers. So it's so rare that we have it all here, but guess what? There's more to it. Not only is it this beautiful leopard, which is impossible to find bone in here, by the way, not real leopard, this is pony hair that has been printed and dyed as leopard, but not only do we have this here, look at this. Wait till you see this beautiful, beautiful interior. You have the gorgeous canvas interior. It says Azadine Alaya here, Cintia Collection. But that's not it. It comes with all of the accoutrements. Once again, guys, only hear what goes around comes around. Are you going to get all the accoutrements? You get the pochette there. You even get the lipstick holder. Amazing, right? And then you also get da 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 this little holder, which is perfect for, you know, I'm not 100% sure. I think it was for like a brush or a compact or like a little toothpick, something of the sorts. <laughs> so all that, and then of course, we're not done. You get this piece, which is great to hold your nail file or anything else you may need. Once again, guys, this is the 90s. <laughs> so remember that, 90s piece for 90s essentials. And then this is where you would keep your mirror right here in this little case and pouch, all in leopard. Miss anything? Nope, that's it, but beautiful. So you get all these items together. Guys, for only $3,500, this is such an iconic piece by Azadine Alaya and Louis Vuitton collaboration. Only them would literally put all this together. It's so stunning and amazing. I love it, absolutely love it. Now, just for the sake of time, I'm gonna put this in here. We'll put these all back together. But once again, guys, $3,500. See, look how cute it would be. Put all of your items with this cute little Louis Vuitton 
Azadine Alaya Pochette Cosmetique that you put right down into your beautiful Alma and off you go to the CFDAs. I mean, this piece is such a cool rare piece to wear. I mean, this is almost like Jenna Lyons basically wore the Bottega clutch like this. So this would have been perfect for her. We love this. Absolutely stunning, stunning piece. Okay, guys. Now we're going to end on another amazing Louis Vuitton item. I mean, this is just the piece to end on. A runway piece, because that's what the CFDAs are about. The Council for Fashion Designers of America, their awards each year. This is the bag we need to end on. Guys, this is a runway piece. This is the Louis Vuitton Black Monogram Fleur de Jay Carousel Bag. I absolutely love this gorgeous fachetta trim all the way around. You even have this beautiful, stunning kind of oversized grained leather. So beautiful. This is fall winter 2010. Look 35 on the runway via VogueRunway.com. Stunning piece, $2,650, you guys. Look, you have that kiss lock, mal lock for this flap. And look at this beautiful piece. It's almost like a mini speedy in a way. And look at this, the fleur de jay. This is all sequined. So first, the first layer, monogram coated canvas. It then has a beautiful gray painting to outline the beautiful fleur de jay, which is French for jasmine flower. And then they have the sequins. Actually, the velvet first, I apologize. The velvet's then laid down, and then they sequin over to certain parts in gray and black to give you this entire beautiful look all the way around, and especially that back, look at that, in which you guys see the base. The base on the Fleur de Jay collection is unbelievable. $2,650 for this piece, you guys, on the runway. And look, you get these two beautiful the shadow trim different pulls. And guys, this basically looks brand new, never used. I mean, insane. I still can't get over like how the condition is. And the fact that this was on the runway, guys, it's so precious. If you want something a little different than the Speedy, this is a great way to go. Look at that satin lining, slip pocket there. You even get the Louis Vuitton into the satin there on the inside. Beautiful, absolutely stunning. Once again, guys, this piece $2,650, look at that base. Beautiful black leather trim. Get that oversized green leather here, gold fee. I mean, this piece is just something that is unbelievably just elegant and beautiful and perfect for CFDAs for any award that you go to. And I love how kind of thin this top handle is up here, elegantly designed. It's just perfect for literally any occasion out there. This is insane. $2,650, I can't believe that price. Most of the time we see these guys upwards of three, $3,500 plus. Comes with a complimentary, what goes around comes around dust bag. It's beautiful, right? Absolutely beautiful piece. Just stunning, look at that. Beautiful, $2,650. Ah, guys, I'm so sad that this is basically the end of our show now. It's the end of the CFDAs. I mean, they ended, but like, I don't want to be done. It's so much fun. Guys, it's just, it's been such a fun evening. Thank you all so much for joining me here tonight, guys. Like this, you guys are the best part of it, especially everyone out there speaking, saying hello. I don't know what i do without you guys. It's the reason I do it, all of you. And now guys, if you're ever in New York City, please, please, please come visit us. I want to meet you in person. It's not enough over the screen for me. I got to see you in person too. We have two amazing locations in the heart of New York City's Soho neighborhood. Our first location at 838, <laughs> 321 West Broadway, the original flagship. We're celebrating 30 years of being in business this year, guys. It's so insane. We have an amazing denim bar, rock and roll vintage tees, tons of in-store exclusives. So come by, let us know you're coming. We'd be happy to pair you with an amazing stylist and find you a great piece to add to your collection or start your collection. And don't worry, if you can't make it, we offer virtual appointments. So you'll still have that amazing, amazing experience just over the phone. And unfortunately, you might have to supply your own bubbles. <laughs> or if we could ship bubbles across state lines, we would. But unfortunately, not yet. Soon, guys. And then, of course, our newest location, the Atelier at 113 Wooster Street, just around the corner from our original flagship. And we're the studio inside the Atelier, guys. So come here, gorgeous, gorgeous marble walls all the way around. Huge space. I mean, every item you can imagine from surfboards to snowboards, Chanel, Louis Vuitton, 
I mean, we have Gucci, tons of gorgeous evening wear and ready to wear for your next event. Once again, follow us on Instagram at WGACA Live and at what goes around NYC. DM us and we'll be happy to set you up at that appointment and I'll get you a glass of bubbles, I promise. Feel free to follow us as well and me at Mason Henry Howell and then of course our wonderful moderator and new host Grace at Ideal.Grace who has a show every Friday at 2 p.m. Eastern Standard Time called Get It With Grace Chosen. It's a name chosen by our amazing Amazon audience and handbag hangout crew out there, of course. Then, last but not least, our West Coast brethren and sister out there, none other than just off Beverly, Rodeo Drive in Beverly Hills. I'm trying to get all of that out there, guys. You know what I'm trying to do. <laughs> so, just off Rodeo Drive, I really mean like a stone's throw off. Some of the best items you'll ever see out there. The most genuine, nicest team you'll ever see as well. We have a Dior Vespa in the window, so you can't miss us. It's so cool, guys, just off Rodeo Drive. So once you can DM us, we also offer those virtual appointments. We can pair you with an amazing stylist to find you the dream piece to add to your collection. And that's where you get to see those in-store exclusives as well. By the way, I might have an in-store exclusive coming tomorrow. You might see it, you might. And then guys, guess what? We're doing a giveaway that is right. So we're giving away three Hermes items, an Hermes Evelyn crossbody, an Hermes 90 centimeter silk carré scarf, and then an Hermes enamel push lock bracelet, very much similar to a click clack bracelet, all of which together goes for over $5,000 plus USD, and it could be yours for free. So all you have to do is head over to our Instagram at WGACA Live, hit that post you'll see that's pinned at the top. All you have to do is follow us, follow us on TikTok at what goes around NYC, and follow us on our other account too, at what goes around NYC on Instagram too. Follow all three just for fun. Might as well, you're already doing it, right? <laughs> and then tag three of your friends on the post and tell us what you'll do with the items. You don't have to do that part, but like I just really wanna hear from you guys what you wanna do with the items. And then guess what? You can enter as many times as you want you just have to tag three different friends, okay guys? And may, let your friends do it as well, or tell them you can all share the bags if all of you win. That's the way to do it. And we're doing the announcement as open until the 28th of November on that, yeah, Cyber Tuesday, on that Tuesday after Cyber Monday, and me and Grace will be announcing the winners together on TikTok and Instagram on November 29th. So you guys have plenty of time to enter, but don't miss out because the more times you enter, the more chances you have to win. It's so exciting, we're ready for it, guys. So, I hope you are too. Now guys, as always, don't forget to follow us on amazon.com slash what goes around comes around so you don't miss out on a moment of these amazing items or me. <laughs> and then head over to whatgoesaroundnyc.com and hit that follow button there. TikTok, Instagram, Facebook, YouTube, and of course, that's it. Instagram, TikTok, Facebook, YouTube, Amazon, what goes around NYC.com. Got them all. There we go, guys. <laughs> As always, guys, I'm your host, Mason Howell. Remember, here at What Goes Around Comes Around, we're constantly chasing the timeless, the iconic vintage pieces, and we're excited to have you guys along for the ride. Take care, and I'll see you guys tomorrow at 1.30 p.m. Actually, 3 p.m. We have Caroline Vazana, our newest host, joining us. So we'll see you guys there, so don't miss out. 3 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, you guys. Take care and have a wonderful evening. Bye-bye.